Hello guys, we are walking to West Campus as we speak. Um, this is because we are going to show you the colleges on West Campus and what there is to offer here. Indeed. How do you feel? Uh, very good, very excited. Yeah. You ready? Yeah. Ready. Enjoy the vlog. Hello, you join me in Alcuin, which is home to Band 3 Ensuite Self-Catered Accommodation. Uh, the college has two different types of common room. We have the junior common room and also the senior common room, which are both past these buildings in that direction. And a fun fact about the college, it was one of the first to be opened at the uni back in 1967. So, yes. Hello there, avid vlog enjoyers. You now join me in Derwent College. Derwent College hosts Band 2, Band 2 Large, Band 3, and Band 3 Large shared and ensuite accommodation. As well as this, they have self-catered and catered options. If you are a catered student here at Derwent, you will have your meals at D-Bar, located just over there, which is Derwent's resident cafeteria. As well as that, Derwent hosts Courtyard, the on-campus student-run bar uh, in Derwent College. A fun fact about Derwent is it was opened by Queen Elizabeth and is home to Longboy, just over here. Longboy is the world's tallest duck and our resident campus celebrity. That's all from me. <coughs> Hello, I'm Virginia and we are now in Halifax College. This college has got band one, two and three rooms. It's shared and ensuite bathrooms and it's self-catered. This college has got two um, common rooms, the JJ's common room and the St. Lawrence common room. It's got air hockey, table tennis, table football and darts. And it also, it's also got the allotment. This college is placed next to the 22 acres and which is also placed in the south entrance of West Campus. So it makes it feel like a cute little village. Hello, I am James and you join me in James. Uh, James College is band three, shared and ensuite accommodation. But the main thing you need to know about James College is that it is catered meaning that you are fed at the roger kirk center monday to friday excluding lunch that means you're going to have to cook for yourself on the weekend um in terms of common spaces in james college we have the lodge and we also have the lake house um and there's a fun fact about james college that i want to let you know of is that james college was named after the first vice chancellor moving on Hello, welcome to Vanborough. Here we have Band 2, Band 2 Large and Band 3 accommodation, which include ensuite and shared bathrooms. Now, the thing about Vanborough is it's catered as well. Uh, if you go to the Vanborough Nucleus, uh, you will get your meals there. Um, it's the same as James College. Um, it's Monday to Friday, excluding lunch times and weekends. Um, now, the communal areas in Vanborough, we have the Warren, um, and there's board game nights and um, music events there. Uh, we have junior and senior common rooms, and um, we have uh, the garage, which is um, where you can go if you've got a, a band or anything. Uh, now, a fun fact about Vanborough is that it's right next to Central Hall, which is a grade two listed building. Um, in terms of common rooms, there is the lodge and the lakeside. All <sighs> of James College is catered, and you go and have your. But hey, hum. Um, it usually happens at the Roger. Oh, it doesn't usually. It happens. Band three shared and ensuite accommodation. It is. College is band three and band four. No, it's not.